Hi there, this is Sophie from Get Data Solution. Get Data Solution produce a dashboard and other data management tools for business and work purpose. The purpose of this channel, Get Data Solution, is to modernize data system to save time to generate automatic report to reduce cost and increase productivity. Today we will see a very important topic which is VLOOKUP using uh, sales data. So in the previous videos we have looked the practical utility of VLOOKUP for budget calculation and for grid reports. see that in other videos today we'll see the sales report using a fixed price over months so uh, our topic is sales report using vluka function so let's assume our price and our products are here the product are mobile Samsung with a price of $250, camera $300, watch $200, laptop $350, desktop $400. So we'll do this price for our calculation and do the sales report. Here is our data. We'll insert the dates on which sales will be implemented, then the month, then uh, we'll just uh, select the products from drop down menu. We are all products we have seen in the above table will be displayed here and we'll select the type of. Uh, product from the existing list either from camera mobile watch laptop or uh, and uh, Samsung so the price will be automatically just generated from the VLOOKUP function this is where VLOOKUP function is used VLOOKUP uh, C2 for example C2 in this particular case is camera and the lookup array in the table is the above table that we have seen this table then the column is two yeah the second column and the rest is matching term so So we'll insert only the quantity required, I mean the quantity sold on that particular day, you know, on January 1, 2021, for example, we have sold 12 cameras, then it will automatically calculate the total price. So our entry in the data should be the date, the month and the quantity sold will get the price from our VLOOKUP function and the total will be automatically calculated. So we'll insert for other uh, products as well. And then if uh, for similarly for the month of February, we we'll select, we we'll write the date and select the product from our drop down list then this uh, sales price will be uh, automatically displayed from VLOOKUP function we write the amount sold or the number sold then we'll get the total uh, sales amount so we'll do in the similar fashion for the rest of the months and in this particular data, we have used 
uh, sample dates only for few dates in the month to demonstrate this but in the actual case you can write every date that sales is actually going on so from that data we, we can generate a very important sales report here for example from that data we have a sales summary by month in this case for example in january we have sold 40,550 which constitute 25 percent of the whole sales amount in that year for february 30,150 which is 18 percent of uh, the total and totally we do we have sold 161,700 and this is the percentage of each month in January we have uh, high sales and that is actually highlighted with green color for example the percentage that what has been done with conditional formatting and selecting top performance we'll do that one by inserting uh, just into the conditional formatting and then uh, selecting the top two uh, top two items and the bottom two items are actually highlighted here in august and in may uh, the lost sales in terms of sales that has been offshore also highlighted with red color uh, that is also uh, just done with using conditional formatting we can do also further analysis we can do analysis by the sales amount by product type for example this can be done by using some function referencing the cell for example in this particular case we have used some if uh, we have used some if c10 to c120 which is this column the first column then c10 to 120 and the referencing h6 h6 is in our case is this is mobile samsung or samsung mobile and then for for the values of total sales we referred this f25 to f120 uh, so we we get the data which is 8250 which constitutes 17 percent of our overall uh, sales about from mobile samsung and we have sold 130 mobile samsung for the camera similarly we have received for 2000 sales by selling 140 product and that constituted 6% uh, from watch, from laptop, from for example from laptop uh, we generated 43,050 by selling 103 uh, laptops that constituted 7% I think that is the biggest one so in this particular case we have uh, use sales reference that is uh, the product but we can also write uh, using some if by referencing item for example in this particular case we can change this h 10 to 9 into laptop in the bracket I mean in the quotation mark then yeah it can generate as well so in terms of uh, 
referencing we can use both the name of the product as well as the reference cell for the remaining one we have used uh, referencing the cell which is in this case is the H column but you can use uh, referencing the item itself in this case as in it indicated we have reference the laptop so you can do the summary of some if using uh, both uh, said referencing as well as referencing uh, the product itself so uh, we have used this uh, sales report using uh, VLOOKUP function. So VLOOKUP function is a very important function to do practical uh, things like solving practical problems. And uh, we recommend people to use VLOOKUP for managing their affairs, including their business. And that's all for today and thank you for watching us and please if you haven't watched so far use uh, using the VLOOKUP application of our, uh, our earlier videos we have uh, generated uh, videos that has actually used VLOOKUP application to calculate budget and create report watch those videos as well so next time we'll look sales reports using variable price over money this one is a fixed price but we'll uh, do analysis using sales report as well using variable price over money so thank you very much and bye bye